Airborne and Ford. That's just about all I can say about it. 152 left out of the fescue here. A little bit into the wind, a little bit uphill. I got eight iron here, just trying to get something up there. Pretty testy lie. Landed right in front of the pen. That was pretty nice. Hit it right at the flag. Ended up just about 15 feet short. Thinking this has got to move just a little bit left, but nice and aggressive with it. Oh, it didn't move left. All right. Never want to birdie the first hole. It's always, I think it's always bad luck to birdie the first hole in my opinion. It just, it just puts you at a, under a lot of pressure for the rest of the round. Second hole, 400 yard par four, big dog leg left. Those bunkers that you maybe can't see, they're like right there. Those are very much in play, so either gotta go right of them or. I mean, that, that flew into the trees, no problem. You know, it might have been a good idea to bring the rangefinder and shoot how far it is to the other the fairway. Mm -mm. That might have been a great idea. There's no good ideas today. Jesus. So we went yaya in the trees. Probably should have looked at where that tree line actually was in all reality. But we're dropping two here. Got 139 of the pin. It's blocked out by the trees here. Uh, just try and save bogey, I guess. Oh, go. Go. Nice shot, Casey. Thanks, dude. Safe to say I chunked that a little bit. It's just short of the green. Not the greatest contact I've ever had on a pitching wedge, but maybe a chance at a little chipping season here. Just potentially. Oh, you got a gig. Good for you. Good for you. A little punch a little lob wedge just to pop it out of that rough it's a decent five at the end of the day all right good opportunity to get one back here third hole par five 529 or so i believe it said on the card been losing the driver right first two holes so i take that into account on this shot Jeez. a little bit of red off on that That was pretty money. Swung up just a little hard. A little hard there. <laughs> pretty ideal look here. Second shot in the par five. 245 to the pin. A little bit downwind. So I'm gonna choke up a little bit on the three wood here and just try and swing smooth. Try and hit this left of the pin, hopefully. Looks like it runs down off this slope to the left. No, just feels cut. Did not see that bounce and that makes me a little nervous. Give y'all a look at from up here what we're dealing with. You can see my ball down there to the right. It's a cute little green for a par five though. Put the pin all the way back. Not all the way back, but most of the way back. A lot of green to work with here. Going uphill the whole way. Try to get this within about six feet. Got a little, little too tentative there. Didn't exactly get it all the way up there, but it's an uphill look at bird. Yep, just about seven or eight feet uphill. Thinking it's gotta go a little bit to the right. Either I pulled that or that just didn't break right. That just doesn't break right. God, wow. First part three of the day, 126. Looks like there's a bit of a backstop there. So I got gap wedge, maybe try and throw this behind and spin it back. Oh, it's too left, way too left. We're dancing. 
We're dancing, but we're on the outside of the dance floor, just kind of not doing much. Long effort here. Up the hill, gonna swing right off that backstop. I got a good feeling about this though, I don't know why. Oh, 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 oh. oh it just never broke. Gave it a hell of a run though. Can't be upset with that. This was a little bit fun. 303 from the blues today. Can't really see the green from here, but it looks real inviting. So I'm gonna give it a rip and see how close I can get. Oh, no, 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 shit. Uh. Came out. To the right, yeah. I just yanked that. Swung a little hard. Oh, we never did find it. Guessing it's in the crick, so I'm taking a drop here. Sick. Oh. Ran it right by, but that had a lot of, a lot of juice on it. But we got a putt for par. All right, downhill look. Got a little bit of a read from Casey, so I think this has got to move right on me. Pretty makeable, I would say. Dude, it moved a lot. Holy. Ah, it's just a bad bogey to make on a par four like that. Number six is pretty, pretty self-explanatory. 369, bunkers on the left. I'm just taking three wood here. Get some out and play for once. Just again, a little bit of a kind of a block, kind of fanned it. I don't know what's over there, but I'm not excited about it. We lost another one right in the hazard. That's three and six holes. We got 102 left. Still have a chance to make par. 102, it's pretty hot today. I'm gonna take 58 here off a pretty, pretty firm lie. So I'm gonna try and knock this down a bit. Zipped it back pretty good. It's makeable. I don't know if it's makeable for me today, but it's makeable. Really don't see this doing a whole lot. I think it's inside the cup. It's up the hill. It's not a confident stroke. Just not confident. Put another two inches of pace on that and it holds. God. All right, 177 here. It's an absolute scorcher today, if I didn't already mention that. So, it's a little downhill, I'm playing at like 170. But I'm going to hit 8-iron, just because ball's flying pretty well. I have no idea. I can't see it. I have no idea. I just can't. I mean, it was just left of the pin, but I, I couldn't see it down. It felt good, though. I have absolutely no idea. Sounded good. No idea where it is, though. All right, not bad. Right at the pin, just underneath it. I think we're still in our ball mark, too. Yep. We sat right down in our ball mark as well. Casey was right behind me here. Pretty straight the whole way up the hill. And just going to curl left at the very end. Bad stroke, but as soon as I hit it, I knew it was too far right. If you would like to donate to the Huddy Golf Ball Fund, my Venmo is HUDD4. Thanks for hitting me up. <laughs> and we got a wedding today, so we got to celebrate a little bit. So here's the Michael and Emma. May you never lose your love like I lose my golf balls. Cheers. <laughs> Part five here for number eight. Uh, it's however many yards is on the screen right now because I didn't look at the scorecard before I got up here. There's that one bunker on the right, but other than that, it's just grip it and rip.
a little toey, but that is right down Broadway. 173 left into this par five. A little bit downwind, a wind that just freshened up as we were driving down this fairway. I'm thinking it's the same eight iron I just hit because 177 and yada, yada, yada. Just trying to hit the same shot I just hit on the last hole. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I didn't cut. Pretty good, though. Don't know how close it is, but it was probably 15, 15 20 feet left of the pin. We got a look. Well, uh, I thought I was on the green, but looks like we got a kick down into the hazard here. I got Casey on the camera for this. Give it a little, little Bill Haas FedEx pump. You know, from the water bus here. It's sitting up on all the tall grass. No real way to know how this is going to come out. This is all guesses. you can do from there just get it out don't leave yourself in the hazard don't make a big mistake hit it yeah. Jeez, that was fucking awful yeah, nice putt nice bucket for me jack Oh God. That's just awful. I'm just gonna hit this really fucking hard cause I'm angry. Touch them all kid. Ended up over on the white tee box of number one. Pretty decent angle though. 120 in, straight downwind, a little uphill. I'm taking 54 degree, gonna try and rip one back. A little fat. Go! Don't know if that even got there. Totally underestimated how soft this grass was gonna be. So, again, I didn't see that bounce. No idea where that ended up. Plugged in the bunker. God is dead. This game hates me. This is just so fucked. Yeah, I mean, it's all you're really asking for. Thank you.